Hey friends, it is time for math. So what you're going to need for this math activity is a dice. You can get it from anywhere in your house. You probably have one uh, with a board game or something. That's where I got mine from, was inside a board game. And it doesn't have to look like this. It can be any kind of dice. So you'll need a dice. And you'll need the paper in your packet that looks like this. And then you'll need your bag of H cubes that you had sent home with you. And those are what we're using today. So this is a game that you can play anytime. And I'm going to tell you how to play it, but then after this video is over, then you can actually play it. So what you do is the first thing you're going to do is you're going to roll your dice and see what number it lands on. So mine landed on number, what number is that? Four, good job, number four. So I'm going to take my chart and I'm going to put four inch cubes, one in each square. So now I have put four in each square. Now I'm going to roll the dice again and it landed on, what number is this? Number five, good job. So now I'm going to put on a different row, I'm going to put how many inch cubes do you think? Five inch cubes because I rolled the number five. So I rolled the number four and then I rolled the number five. And then now I have I'm going to count how many I have all together. So go ahead and count. Let's count how many. So the first time I rolled four. So I put one, two, three, four. And then the second time I rolled a five. So I put one, two, three, four, five. Now, how many are there all together? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Once you have counted how many you have all together, um, I want you to, if you have them, get the green number bag. Um, it's a baggie with numbers inside and I believe that they're green. You can find the number or make it the number that matches how many you have all together. And then once you've done that, then you can clear off your board and start over and you can play it again. And that's the game for today. Make sure you are counting and using your finger to count if you're getting mixed up. You can use your finger to point to what you're counting. Alright, that's all for today.